Good afternoon, everyone. This is Steve Kime with the City of Enid, along with Derek Silas, and we're at the ABC Park right here at North Van Buren. Just a gorgeous baseball park and a gorgeous day today. It makes you want to get out and play baseball. But we wanted to provide you this update on the bridge replacement project that will take place this year on North Van Buren, the U.S. Highway 81 bridge. Um, the um, Oklahoma Department of Transportation is going to be replacing that bridge. In March this month, they were letting out uh, bids on the project. The estimation for the construction start could be sometimes late this summer. That is an ODOT decision. It's not a city of Enid or city government decision. It's an ODOT decision. And uh, we're in the Ambux Park, and one of the reasons for doing so, it's a great view of the bridge to be replaced, but Ambux will also put flag mounts on the fencing to mount U.S. flags on on a patriotic day. So in other words, there's gonna be flag mounts on the side of the bridge. So on July 4th or Veterans Day, Memorial Day, uh, the Ambux will put flags out that will go across the, uh, the new bridge when it's built. The uh, PACE, the Public Art uh, Commission group, has uh, approved the design of the, the, the um, I guess you would say, the bridge embankment area. They'll have a picture of the Sisatel flycatcher, and the bridge siding will have sides and a walkway. The siding will have pictures of wheat and uh, very, you know, reflective of Indian Oklahoma. Those pictures of the Sisatel fly, flycatcher and also the wheat were displayed during the city commission meeting on Tuesday, and you can find that on the City of Enid website. So uh, the Sisatel flycatcher, of course, is the state bird. And again, there'll be a pedestrian walkway on each side of the bridge. And once construction gets underway, hopefully late this summer, early fall, uh, the construction is expected to last 12 to 18 months. So here we are at home plate at the ABC Park, the gorgeous park, one of the great quality of life features here at the City of Enid. Just providing you an update on getting that old bridge finally replaced. Reporting Facebook Live for the City of Enid, Steve Kine.